Exactly, man. So uh, life after football, the trials and tribulations that you learned through all of it. How have you applied yeah, well, to your personal life? Yeah, you know, of course, we didn't make the money, you know, back then the guys make today. So immediately was, you know, I had to get to work. Uh, yes, sir. Um, my wife started making uh, a lunch for me every day and saying, I don't care where you go, but you got to go somewhere. So get out. <laughs> <laughs> and so I went into sales and I've been into sales ever since. And, uh, you know, I've got two kids and, and they're both grown, you know, 28, 26 now. And uh, one of them's a firefighter and my daughter's a firefighter here in Arlington, Texas, where I live. And my son works for me as one of my sales reps at the company I'm the sales manager at. And um, I've had a lot of surgeries and just beat up. You know, I've had knees replaced and shoulders replaced and, Hmm. you know, foot fused and neck fused and the thumb repair surgery. And it's so besides that, everything else is good, man. You know, there's nothing to complain about. Definitely, man. So uh, what advice would you give a younger player, man? That's coming as far up. as uh, that's in college or coming into yeah. pros? Going into the pros. Well, you, you, I, I tell every time I speak to even high school kids, it really starts in about the 10th grade, okay? Boys don't really hit their full peak puberty till, you know, 10th, 11th grade. And I can just tell you one thing, when you're a high school star and you go to college, you are not a star anymore, okay? Everybody in college is good, okay? And you're not gonna go out there and rush for 5,000 yards against Alabama, and, you know, OU and schools like that. So you have to grind through it. Number two, you have to stay clean and stay, uh, keep, get your education. Um, you have to play three years. I tell everybody that, uh, that the reason the NFL has the rule where you have to play till you're a junior is because physically you can't go from high school to the pros. You would get destroyed. I mean, it wouldn't be good. And uh, mind your own business, take care of your school, be a good person, work hard, and do what you can to get on the field to be noticed. And that's the greatest advice that I can give them.